I bet you never heard of this animal before, a kuligo. I took a river journey last night here in Borneo, Malaysia on the Kitabatangan River and we were lucky enough to see this amazing animal. I'm Dr. Stephanie Shuttler and my channel is all about empowering scientists and inspiring you to conserve our natural world. In this video, I show you the footage I took and talk about why kuligos are so cool. This kuligo is perched on a tree, but if it were all stretched out, you would see that it has a skin membrane connected between its hands and feet and even its tail. This makes the kuligo look like a flying squirrel, but they are not flying squirrels. They are in their own order, and the animal group that they are most closely related to is primates, actually. Like flying squirrels, they use this membrane to glide from tree to tree. They can glide very long distances, up to 150 meters. That's even longer than a whole football field. I wasn't expecting to see a kuligo because they're nocturnal. And you can see they blend really well into the trees. We heard this one chirp. That's how we discovered it. Because their membrane extends to their tail, they can actually fold it over and use it like a pouch. They can hold their babies in there. When they glide from tree to tree, you can see the baby hangs on underneath their belly. It is so cute. It's also so amazing that the baby can hang on that well. It looks like it should fall off, doesn't it? Thank you so much for watching, guys. If you like this video, please share it with a friend and make sure you subscribe to my channel. I have lots of videos on Malaysia and the cool animals that I found. And you can also find me at fancyscientist.com.